Five Ukrainians were killed by the Russian military in response to activity near the border of the two countries. These are the first casualties that have been recorded since the Russians started to position their forces along the Ukrainian border in spring 2021. How did we get here? Fighting tension between Ukraine and Russia has existed since the annexation of the Crimean Peninsula in March 2014 over the same issues that Ukraine and Russia are facing today. Ukrainian membership into NATO. The result is the insidious dismantling of Ukraine by Russia. After the Crimean crisis, rebel forces supported by Russia has formed resistance in the Donbass region. The pro-Russian base of power situated in southeast Ukraine, hosting 15% of the country's population. At the expense of over 14,000 lives, rebel forces have been gaining in strength over the years and this breakaway region, which includes Donetsk and Luhansk, has been officially recognized by the Russian government. This recognition allows for the pretext for Russia sending in troops to perform what it calls peacekeeping functions. The source of this conflict is a dispute around a difference of beliefs. NATO believes it has the unmitigated right to expand farther east into the Eurasian landmass, most notably into Ukraine and to Georgia. Russia believes this expansion into its spheres of influence as both Ukraine and Georgia share a border with Russia is an existential threat. This is the classic case of an unstoppable force meaning an immovable object. 